Hey, what's going on guys? This is the Flight Sim Deck. My name is Patrick. Uh, today we're going to take a look at a project I've been working on for uh, about a year on and off. And uh, that is these 737 panels that um, I created in Illustrator. And I did this because I plan on building a 737 simulator myself. And all the panels I could find for free were just really poor quality. They weren't always accurate and they just didn't look good enough so I decided I would make my own and I spent a very long time on this one this is the lower overhead panel I still haven't done the upper but as you can see over here I have every single piece um, for the panel done it took a very long time to do this um, zoom in here and show you a little bit of it and I'm gonna have these for download on my website for you guys, so uh, I'll get to that in a moment, how you can get a hold of that. Uh, move down the line on what I have. Um, this is the MCP panel for the 737. Um, you can print these out and use them for uh, either as like a novelty thing on your desk, or uh, my original purpose was to just have them as templates so I would know the size of every panel and how it will be placed you know in real life uh, they're not to like the exact millimeter it's it's pretty hard to find dimensions for these well I mean you can find them but you know I, I see different measurements for on different sources so you know I kinda just go off my different research that I found and uh, so, like I said, it's not to the exact millimeter, I'm sure, but it's definitely in the ballpark. It's really close. These are to to the uh, real life size of these. So here's the, here's the MCP panel. Um, here's the CDU. I just finished this one um, recently. So that's the this one. I have the main panel that I was working on. I'm not done with this one yet, but I got the glare shield and I got. The top of it done. Uh, this one I will not will not be on the website yet because it's not done. And then I have uh, this. This is a Cessna 172 that I've started, and it, it's not done yet. It's going to take a little while. If there's any panels that you would guys would like me to draw, um, I'll do it by majority, and I can put them on the site. I mean, it won't be done overnight. It'll probably take me a while, but I can at least start working on it. If there's something you guys would like to see, uh, this is the yoke checklist. I use this one on my desk. You can print it out, mount it to uh, foam core or some type of cardboard or anything you want like that. You know, print it, mount it, and then you can stick it to your yoke and kind of make it look like you have a 737 um, yoke. So yeah, you can just do that, you know. Um, you might want these on your desk. You might be building a, a simulator or you want to like cut your own plastics. These are uh, great to go off of. So, yeah, they'll be up on the website. So let's go over there right now. It's the homepage, theflightsimdeck.com. You can go over to Downloads. That is now an active page. And I have all of them listed right here. All the ones available at the moment. There will be more in the future. Um, just click them, and it should load a PDF. And you can just uh, use this PDF file to um, print it. And, uh, yeah, each one is a PDF. But anyways, guys, yeah, these are the downloads uh, that I was talking about earlier in the week when I launched the website, and they are now live and available for you guys, so go ahead and head on over there, check them out, download them, and yeah, I, I don't think you'll find any others like this on the web. I'm pretty sure I have the highest quality panels for free, you know, the, maybe the ones you pay for are, are better, but at least for free, these are the, the best and most accurate out there. Um, Alright guys, uh, check it out and um, I'll be talking to you later. See ya.